Hi, this is Engine Talk, and today we've got uh, Mahindra Zylo at the workshop. The problem with the car is as soon as we switch the ignition on, this particular fuse burns out. Sometimes the car, while running, it burns out, and sometimes as soon as we put the ignition on, it uh, fuses off. After going through the circuit diagram, the other problem that's happening is uh, when once this uh, uh, fuse burns out, we have the check engine light that uh, illuminates, and the once we do once we do a scan, we get the EGR error. So the circuit diagram says uh, that as uh, this fuse. Um, activates the stop lights as well as it activates the EGR modulator. We've gone and removed this uh, modulator, and uh, this is the wiring to the modulator. As you can see uh, it may have been shorting to ground, that's the reason why it was blowing the fuse. So I've just left it out. The, the check engine light will be on because it will trip an EGR error. So I'll put a new fuse, I'll start the car and see if the fuse blows, gets burnt out again. <clears throat> then we take it from there. So I'm just going to put in a new fuse and we'll see once I switch the ignition on whether it burns out or not. So you can see the fuse is still intact. I'm gonna start the car and then we'll check it again. As you can see the check engine light is on. That's because I have disconnected the EGR modulator. And the fuse is still intact. Earlier, as soon as I start the vehicle, it would trip an error, or sometimes even just by turning the ignition on, it would trip the error. So, what I'm going to do is, you can see here the fuse is still connected. Uh, it's still okay. So I'll connect the. Uh, EGR modulator back and then we'll come and check the fuse and see if it's blown. Let's see if the fuse is okay. So, if the fuse is okay, we'll take it for a drive and see if it uh, checks out. As you can see,
the fuse is still intact so I guess the wiring the insulation that was uh, bad the wiring was shorting to the ground and that's the reason the fuse was blowing out so hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching uh, one more thing is I will uh, do a scan and uh, erase the EGR error and uh, as you can see the check engine light is off and the vehicle is still running problem sorted thanks for watching